Palm Sunday and the year is 1461. In this remote field in Yorkshire, two massive armies are facing each other, preparing to go into battle. The weather's freezing and the snow begins to fall, and men at both sides are praying to their God for victory and for deliverance. But they both know that no quarter will be asked nor given. Suddenly the sky becomes dark with deadly arrows. Soldiers scream as they're hit, but this is only the beginning. Soon men are in pitch battle, hacking at each other with their swords and axes. Skulls are crushed, limbs are severed, and the snow runs red with blood. The Battle of Towton is in full cry. It's almost impossible for us to imagine the hell of medieval pitch battles. The bloodlust, the noise, the sheer brutality of the fighting. They were tests of strength, endurance, and of course, raw courage. It was quite literally kill or be killed. Over the next hour, we'll get to see why weapons such as the pole axe and the longbow were so deadly in the hands of medieval men at arms. That is going to hurt. We'll also see the effects they had on the human body and how the wounds they inflicted were treated. We'll find out how the weapons were made and what men did to try and protect themselves. And we'll try to get into the hearts and minds of the men that fought here at Towton more than 500 years ago.